We're here with 50% schematic design of the new Denver Justice Center courthouse, and we're excited that at this stage, which is halfway through schematic design, we've achieved all the six aims we initially set out. Definition of a new public space, courtrooms which all get natural light, attention to public waiting, light and justice, sustainable green aspects, and architecture of material and fine proportions. On the first point, the Tremont axis sets up the, the feeling of the main entrance space on the east. We form two public spaces then, one on the east and one on the south. That you can see the wonderful way that we connect on the Tremont axis back to the core and the heart of the city. There's a wonderful embracing and forming of the public space. So there's a double connection this building makes. One with Tremont and the other aligning with all the buildings all the way up to the, the Capitol and with the Tower of Light. Every courtroom in this building is a shaped vessel to get natural light, which allows the movement of natural light over a shelf that's on the side of the jury. So the feeling of the courtroom then is really one of the change of light in the day, the change of light in the seasons, something that adds the human dimension to the nature of this public space. The idea of natural light then also allows the building, which becomes a space-forming building that brings public waiting into a wonderful place where instead of a double-loaded corridor being dark and on the inside, benches are along the outside edges and the public waiting has views out to the mountains on the west and natural light all during the day. Light and justice. And so this building really is about light, whether it's the inside of the courtroom, but also the main circulation of the elevators is in what we call the Tower of Light. That also connects with the Campanile-like elements in the neoclassical architecture on the main axis. During the day, it also serves as a solar stack, taking sunlight in and actually working as a cooling mechanism and as a passive solar heating mechanism for the HVAC system in the building. Sustainable green aspects permeate our work here, and we feel as a public building this really is got to be an exemplary building. We have a green sedum roof, which can actually be accessed by the fifth floor doors here. There's a semi-public terrace, which also gives you a view back down Tremont. There are many elements in the use of the materials, natural and non-toxic materials, the use of natural wood in the courtrooms. We would like to use the materials that are connected to the site, red rocks, in Colorado, red sandstone and these wonderful warm tones. We're thinking of a series of sunscreens in that kind of warm red color and paving that works in that same Colorado stone. To summarize then, we have all the six aims that we originally set out in, back in the early spring. We've achieved that. We have a building that's on budget, has all the program in it, and has all the potential to be a great piece of public architecture for a great city. Thank you.